Did you know hand washing is something that is mentioned in the Bible? In Exodus chapter 30, verses 17 through 21, God lays out the practice by which the priests are to approach the altar, washing their hands first. Leviticus lays out several instances of ritually washing the body and clothes whenever someone has come into contact with something ritually unclean, which often was unclean as a matter of health as well. The New Testament also makes reference to the laws concerning washing one's hands. Now, before anyone tries to argue, there is a passage in Mark 7 when the Pharisees and some of the scribes chastised Jesus because not all his disciples are washing their hands before they eat. Jesus, in turn, reproaches them for focusing on the wrong things and not the things of God, such as, in Jesus' words, honoring your father and mother. Washing one's hands would have been much more difficult to do in Jesus' time. It is much easier to do so now especially in times when disease and illness run rampant. Caring for others, which is at the heart of what Jesus says in this passage, means preventing the spread of disease. We should also not forget that Jesus says it is what comes from within that defiles us. Here, Jesus means evil words and acts, Though we could also take this as a reminder to do the vampire cough, like so, into our sleeves, and not into our hands, or, heaven forbid, someone else's face. So wash your hands. It's in the Bible.